everyone was like, oh, you're going to work on Harry Potter? Because the first one had just come out. And I was like, oh, come on, man, like, give me a chance. I guess they're going to make seven of them, so maybe by the time we get to the seventh, maybe I'll be working on Harry Potter. And then I finished my last exam, uh, unlike June the 4th, June the 7th was my first day at Fremster, I went, you're working on Harry Potter. Um, and, and I was like, yes! Jenny von Tantelman and I'm one of the CG supervisors at Double Negative in London. Um, I am here at the Visual Effects Summit to talk about the latest film I worked on which is Interstellar, specifically the science side of Interstellar. I was, I was one of the two CG supervisors on the project um, and I was focused on the, uh, the black hole, the wormhole um, and the sort of hyperspacey high dimensional space time bit at the end. Um, black holes, uh, because of their high gravity, they warp um, space in the area around them and then light no longer travels in straight lines, it moves in curved paths, so we had to write um, a new ray tracer to to, to um, follow these curved light paths, which is what you see when you see the black hole in the movie, so um, hopefully you've enjoyed it. I worked very closely with Kip Thorne, who's the film's scientific advisor and also executive producer, um, and also with Oliver James, who's the chief scientist at Double Negative. Um, just to mix things up a bit, because that's the only film I'm talking about at the moment, um, my second favourite project was Hellboy 2, um, which, which was just fascinating. I loved working with Guillermo del Toro, and I just loved doing crazy fantasy fairy tale stuff. I'm also here to talk, uh, to be part of the Women in Animation panel, which I think is really, really important because um, women are very underrepresented in, in um, animation and visual effects, but also, to be honest, in pretty much all aspects of STEM um, jobs, so science, technology, engineering and maths. I'm from an engineering background, um, and I think it's been absolutely fantastic. Like I just, I just love it, and it upsets me that women often feel discouraged from going into that kind of thing, so I'm here to kind of promote that and talk about it and how we might be able to change things. Yeah.